how to release for speed, not to release for squaring the face. So many of you, when you're coming in, what I mean by releasing for squaring the face is you're swinging down here, and as you come into it, you're letting go of all your power so that you can get that club face square at that time. That's releasing for face, and when you do that, you get rid of all of your power prior to the time when you wanna have it, and that is in the impact position. We wanna release for power, so all of this gets retained, and we release the energy out that way. Now, what does that feel like? Well, all you gotta do is take a little trip to the beach, and by the way, those of you that are up in the Northeast that are freezing, this is not a bad idea. When you go to the beach, you're gonna get yourself one of these little games, it's almost like playing highlight. And what I want you to do is I want you to just throw this ball and get a feel of what it feels like to hang on to the bend in the elbow, hang on to the bend in the wrist, and let it go out here like that. And what you're gonna find when you do that is it's a different release than what you do with your golf swing because you're releasing way back in here so you have no power. You get in here and you release all that out like that, that angle hangs on and then you let go of it. Now, ah, we don't need that anymore. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that and we're gonna transition that into this golf swing. So when we come through here, I wanna feel like I've got that highlight ball in there just like that and I'm gonna release that out into the fairway. And as I start to do that, all the energy goes down over here. And in fact, when we do this properly, you can hear that noise happen very, very late. It happens out here. When you're swinging, you're doing this. And it's dull. And it looks clumsy. And you're getting holes in your glove and the heel and in the thumb because all your energy is going in the wrong direction back here. You want to be able to let this go over here and now and when we start to do that what happens is is we start to generate tremendous power and as we get that tremendous power we start to hit the ball really far